All right, guys, we're out here hunting. Well, I'm out here hunting. Came alone th uh, now. Um, been hunting the whole day, haven't got much. But there's heaps of mushrooms around, so I'm going to hunt them. Um, it's end of April. Uh, end of April, and, we, uh, and we've had really nice rain. So that means that all these mushrooms out, and I'm going to show you in a minute. Uh, over here in these pine forest you can pick two types of mushrooms uh, two types are edible as far as I know one is the um, what we call the saffron milk cap I'm going to show you there's one right here this is what it looks like okay that there's this saffron milk cap the other one is what we call a slippery jack slippery jack that's how Slippery Jack looks like. Okay. There are many others out here. Oh, there's one right here I'm going to show you. This one here is a fly agaric, also known as a toadstool. That's really, really poisonous. So you should stay away. And then you have all these small brown ones around some poo over there. Um, but we're going to leave all of those alone. And we're going to stay with those which we know. Now when you go out mushroom picking it's an important it's important to have like a pocket knife with you or something so you can just cut them off rather than breaking the whole thing off. Okay, I tried that but it didn't work, the whole thing came out. Important as well, when you take your mushroom, see how how red it is, nice red, orange. You can see it as well. Even though the fly agaric is red and orange and yellow as well, it has a fat stem and uh, yeah, it just looks really, really different. It's like it has like a saffron color, that's why it's called, that's, hence its name. Okay, so that's one. Okay, pop it in here. Now when you keep them as well, it's important that you keep them all separate in like an open area so that because what happens if you have them all together what will happen is that they'll uh, damage each another and what happens is that they turn uh, green and, and uh, it's not bad but it doesn't look nice also when you're picking them or also when you're having a look for them try and pick out the most um, youngest looking ones or most freshest looking ones the ones with the nice that are firm and have a nice orangey color anyone which is like a bit dark or faded or anything just leave it alone now guys often where you find one of them you'll find others hidden so have a look at him he's hidden over there see see his quality yep he's not too bad he'll go in there we go and then another one Let me cut him off like that how does he look yep he looks nice pop him in there we go, take all that rubbish out. Beautiful. Alright, so what I want to show you up here, this is poisonous. This here is a fly agaric. Now have a look at that compared to an actual milk cap. You can see even though the colour is slightly the same, but have a look at it. It has a long stem and it's white and it has a fill at the end as well. That there is poisonous, stay far away from that. And you can see around here as well, we've got some other types of mushrooms and fungus and whatever have you. Stay far away from them. So if you just have a look at this over here, it's really, really easy to see. These are all the different um, shapes and colours of the fly agaric. Uh, it is poisonous, stay away from it, stay away from it. Um, as you can see you have a whole whole army of them over here but they're really really easy if you know what you're looking for they're really easy to um, recognize but as as is always if in doubt leave it out okay guys so here we have it we have a few mushrooms I've only filled up two containers the reason why because I want to start hunting now the other reason is because my wife is not that sure if you can eat them. 
So she says that I should eat them first. If I don't fall down dead, then she'll eat them. All right. So we have a few, um, we only have a few of these slippery jacks, but we have plenty, plenty of the um, milk caps. Uh, there's heaps around this. There's a lot, there's a lot around, but uh, that's all I'm going to take for now.